Frank Hall underneath. Will Chamberlain going to the foul line. Chamberlain missed again. Chamberlain is 0 for 4 from the foul line. Well, big number 13. He missed it. He is not a great threat at the foul line. Though he has done better, I think, this year than any time in his career. Next to second. The basic problem with the big people is small people are teaching them how to shoot a free throw so that the big people have too much motion in the shot. And so many things go wrong. They cannot soften the shot up enough because they're too strong. Now, I'll give you an example. You mentioned Will Chamberlain. I saw Will Chamberlain once. We all, if you follow the game way back then, he was a notorious poor free throw shooter like Shaq and like Howard and, and, the, and the guy Jordan in this era. And um, I saw him go to half court and make 20 out of 25 free throws from half court. Will had a great shot outside. He used to win games in order. I'm going to tell you something. As bad as it looks, you didn't miss by that much. You just seen me make two in a row. <laughs> no, I had to sap for a fast. There you go. The other is out. I just played the last three of them. I don't care. This is the one I'm talking about for five hours. Get up! Get up! I was totally amazed. The guy was just so strong. Too strong. They, they can't soften the shot up, and they have too much motion in the shot. If I was teaching free throws to the big guys, I have them put the ball here and shoot it from there. Not all this mechanics of arm and, you know, push the legs. And, I mean, Will Chamberlain's the best shot other than the roll down the fingertips into the basket shot was the fall away jumper. Yeah. Because that took his strength away so he could t soften, soften his shot. And what people couldn't understand is he could put the ball in a basket with three guys hanging off his arms, some guy biting him on his shin, and uh, now you take everybody away and it's like the basket is moving. Grabbing Wilt to prevent him from dunking the ball. Chamberlain's free throwing, questionable in the past. He says it'll improve sharply in Los Angeles. How do you not try anything to get better? There was one star who decided to give the underhanded method a try. Notoriously poor free throw shooter, Wilt Chamberlain. Well, I never really got to talk to Wilt about his free throws until after he had been retired, and I just joked with him. I said, you know, you should have come to me. I admire the fact that you tried underhanded at one time. I said, but your technique sucked. Big guys have a tendency to grab the ball. I actually saw this, and I think to this day people don't believe it, but he, he, he wasn't at the top of the circle, but he was about three steps behind it on a free throw and he ran to the free throw line, took off and dunked the ball. And in the rules at that time, you could. I think I could have been very definitely instrumental because I was chairman of the Basketball Coaches Rules Recommendation Committee. And I explained to the coaches at the convention what I saw and said that, you know, something's gonna have to be done so that we, you know, don't have guys that can dunk the ball on the free throw line. And they changed that rule. They changed the rules uh, when Will was in the game and he got three to make two. He had three to make two. Uh, even then, at that time, you foul Wilt if he was underneath the lane. And uh, one night, we were in a playoffs against Philadelphia when he was still with Philadelphia. And they fouled out both Walt Bellamy and Willis Reed and I ended up having to be the third center to go in and play Wilt in a double overtime game. So it was one of those things. But the thing with Wilt is he would he took me up with him when he went up to shoot a shot. Gives it to Chamberlain. Drops it in and he's fouled. He was that strong. <laughs> he was very strong. Makes the first one. Losing is something that you don't like to accept. Every time you lost at anything, whether you lost missing a foul shot, lost the whole game, it bothers me a great, great deal. It found in fact, it probably bothered me more than I even realized. Chamberlain misses, gets his own rebound, no good. Chamberlain was over the line, too fast, 
thoughts on that play? So the one that they'd always look at is, well, he doesn't shoot free throws well. Chamberlain makes the foul, gets another one. He has 90 points. 90 points. That night he made 28 out of 32, which is pretty good, I think. You said something about foul shooting, and I think you'll admit you were not the world's greatest foul shooter. Some people <laughs> Except under pressure. Except under pressure. Although not the greatest foul shooter, Wilt can make them when there is something at stake. Today, it's only the last two points in the game. It's clutch time now. The 76ers take the lead by one. And some have actually theorized that the reason Will Chamberlain was not a great foul shooter was, even if it was subconscious, to prove to everybody that he was only human. Human, absolutely. I, I, I agree with that 100%. My teammates might not agree with that. But, no, you know, I was really a good foul shooter up until a certain time in my career. A dead eye at charity throws, Chamberlain draws many opportunities to demonstrate his accuracy from the foul line. I just got progressively worse. I think it was totally a head, head case. You can say whatever you want. Uh, I uh, shot foul shots very good when I concentrated. But I lost my concentration, and, and people always would say, hey, do it this way, do it that way, and whatever, you know. They didn't know any better than I did. I was just, you know, I just missed a lot of fouls. I went to a psychiatrist just then, you know, and uh, for about a month uh, on, my, on my free throw situation. After a month, I, I, I gave it I gave it up. Somebody else paid, paid for a session, $50 a session. I won't say it wasn't. You know, and I, after, <laughs> after I came out of it for a whole month, I, I, uh, the psychiatrist was a better free throw shooter than I was. <laughs> 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 you know, that's, 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 how, that's how it happens, you understand? Know